let's have a look at the Vienna Advantage um, system so um, as you can see a Vienna Advantage um, runs in a browser so I've opened Vienna Advantage in a Chrome browser and uh, which means I can run it without any local installation on um, all sorts of devices wherever you can run a browser you can run Vienna Advantage um, I can log in with the username and password so let me just do that and then I have the option to uh, select languages. So VN Advantage supports um, all sorts of languages. We have, of course, a lot of language packs readily available. Um, and uh, for instance, also VN Advantage supports the right to left languages such as um, Arabic or Persian, etc. Additionally, also, for example, we can support Chinese and, uh, and other languages. So. Um, localizing or adapting to different languages is, is quite easy using the translation management module inside VN Advantage. Um, you can mark if you are using your personal computer or a fixed computer you can uh, mark the remember me so next time when you get into the system or open the URL you won't need to log in um, and uh, you will be directly led to inside the system. So um, I am logging into the system now, in the course of login, um, my username and password is checked, and of course, um, it is um, checked to what role I have access to. So, in this case, I have access to various roles. However, the Ideas Inc. admin role is my default role. Hence, um, all the settings, um, all the windows, menus, etc., is loaded according to the role, which is my pre-selected role. If I want to have a different view on my system, I can get into a different role and, and view the system accordingly. Um, of course, I'm logged into the Ideas Inc. Um, tenant and I have access to different um, organizations under that um, tenant. Now I'm logging into the start level, which basically is the master data management level. Now here is a quick, um, um, yeah, it's, a, it's basically a home page uh, when you log into the system and the home page is role specific and the content that is presented to you on this role is very much role specific as well. So related to the business data that you, um, uh, your role probably is interested in. Um, so let me explain you the components. So first of all, uh, we have here in the boxes certain alerts which are relevant to every user irrespective of which department um, the user is working in. Um, and uh, one of the things, first of all, there is a workflow inbox. So we an advantage, as we know, has a workflow um, a management system inside inbuilt. So any kind of approvals or alerts are presented to you here inside. So in this case, I can see workflow activities, activities which have come in for me, and I can reply to those uh, with an approval which I can grant for here. If I would like to forward it to some other um, colleague, I can do that or I can write a message on that uh, if I need to pass on some comments. Um, of course, if it is related to a sales order, I can see it right in the beginning that it is related to the sales order number. This is related to a customer um, bell stationery. And if I would like some more details, I can also mouse over here to see the grand total in that case. Uh, so it gives me some quick overview to take my decision, but in case I would like to know more about that document, I can of course get into that uh, document by zooming into and it will take me to that particular order which is currently under my approval. Um, then uh, we also have notifications um, which could be system generated notifications uh, or alerts which you set for yourself. Um, you can set up alerts inside the complete system across uh, different modules on data. So for instance if you want to be alerted on certain occasions for example if the sales is in a month is not crossing um, a certain uh, threshold so you can set up all sorts of alerts um, according to the data requirements and then the alerts can be uh, presented to you inside the system here uh, on your home page or these can be also sent to you on an email or even um, sent to your SMS uh, or through an SMS to your, to your mobile device uh, for the SMS of course you need to subscribe to a um, provider which can be again linked with VN Advantage to generate and, and deliver the SMS. Um, then we also have your request inbox. So requests are basically some kind of tickets um, um, or internal requests or customer requests which can be presented to you which can be routed to you through the workflow based on your role and in this case I can see that there are two requests which have come in for me. 
I can here also zoom to that particular request and uh, basically work on uh, my response to that request which is now there is a quant some quantity not delivered uh, related to an order uh, which I can see I can zoom from here to that order I can view the business partner zoom from here to that business partner and also record my response against that ticket um, so it has an inbuilt ticketing system uh, which um, pre is presented to you quickly on your uh, inbox for the request. Additionally, also you have an inbuilt calendar where you can manage your appointments. So appointments can be related to certain records as well. So I can zoom from here to those records. This is a meeting request um, which I could approve. And then of course it will be displayed in my calendar which is an inbuilt tool um, without the need of any kind of exchange server etc. So um, you can have your calendar and synchronize that also with your Google um, account so that you have um, all the data present in your ERP system as well as maybe your mobile device. Additionally, you can manage your tasks so you can record a new task, for example, a demo to a customer. So I can quickly record a task. I could edit this task, maybe I can in assign it to some other person, invite them, etc. So, which means you can also delegate tasks. Um, here, uh, this is a delegate task which I have delegated to Caroline um, and I can always get update on what has been done yet on this task. Um, we also have some notes which I can um, enter here if I would like to keep a note um, of something then I can um, do it here. And additionally we have some KPI and uh, document um, part as well over here. And then the middle area, this is also very interesting, it's a kind of um, your Facebook homepage where you get the latest um, information and news about what is related to you and here you're getting basically alerts on and follow-ups on those records which are relevant to you which you have subscribed to in this case I have subscribed to this customer called Max Limited and if there is some kind of a message or a chat placed on that I'll be able to see that immediately on my homepage so that I can react to that in fact, in fact, I can zoom from here to that record as well and um, see what what chat has been um, recorded over here and additionally also reply from here or I could even reply from from here um, so and it will be archived back to that record as well. Then on the right hand we have the um, I would say role favorites so these are favorites which are placed by the administrator to you and uh, which are relevant to that particular role and additionally we have also personal favorites so you can go to the menu anywhere for example and place something to your to your favorites so that you can quickly access those windows and those functions um, from the favorites menu itself um, just a little bit inside on this one for example we have a contact management uh, which allows you to basically search for your contacts to manage your contacts and uh, yeah do certain activities like writing an email, um, doing some um, appointments with them um, and even sometimes like if it is um, a customer so for example I could select a customer and if I would like to create an order I could create uh, immediately decide to create a sales order in that case and uh, in that case what is going to happen is that the customer is going to be pre-selected uh, in my uh, in the window um, with all the information and in all the terms which I have with this customer including the sales price list payment terms etc so a very quick way of of course recording um, and business data into the system as well and here I can search for different contact types like customers vendors employees or even prospects I can synchronize the data here also with Google I could do some full text search based on emails phone numbers etc or I could even here search for some specific locations if I would like to plan a tour and I was looking for people in a certain city or a certain zip code I could search for um, companies and contacts according to that so that's another part which uh, which is available here in the favorites as well and uh, you can place also other uh, custom forms or forms available inside VN Advantage and that's in this part um, then we have a menu of course um, the menu of course has um, a lot of modules as you can see material management company and global settings um, define your company structure including your organization structure we have product management marketing including marketing campaign 
um, and of course um, also planning these campaigns executing the campaigns and also segmentations um, in the product management we have also a very nice uh, product management form which allows us to um, search for products to manage products also there's a product tree which um, you can use to, to scroll through and drill into the products um, and there are various quick functions um, related to the product management um, yeah then additionally also we have uh, partner relationship management which covers the customer relationship management as well as the supplier relationship management which also includes a performance analysis module um, for defining SLAs by these partners and tracking those as well like um, quality of delivery uh, timely delivery and so on additionally we have a sales management which includes um, the complete cycle from lead um, to the customer uh, but also you can plan and forecast your sales um, you have plenty of sales reports as well and um, additionally we also have a commission management module which allows us to run and, and calculate commissions inside the system then there's an order management which includes uh, managing sales orders service contracts and of course invoicing of those we also have a blanket blanket sales order functionality for long-term contracts with your customers and uh, for quick uh, order management we also have an order management module um, or a form which allows you basically to yeah, search for orders um, uh, execute orders and maybe check the status of the orders like um, in a very graphical and, and easy to track way you can basically manage your orders inside the order management um, then also um, additionally we have a pricing and discount management um, so you can have multiple price lists in VN Advantage and define your discounting terms based on business partners additionally there is a purchase management module including the RFQ purchase order matching um, and returning to the vendor so the complete cycle of purchasing is covered returns of course as well um, then um, a complete financial management so that is of course a very strong module inside VN Advantage including defining your accounting structure your tax management for the VAT to automatically select the VAT rate at the time of transaction receivables payables cash management bank management so all sorts of uh, financial transactions we also have post dated check functionality and um, yeah additionally of course um, time and expense management budget and controlling where you can of course plan your budgets track um, the actuals against those and a costing module which allows you to track the product costs um, request management for handling the tickets etc project management and um, fix asset management manufacturing etc etc so a bunch of modules basically covering all sorts of enterprise needs um, additionally of course there are various um, modules available inside the market um, the marketplace is something like an app store where you can subscribe to new modules um, including language packs um, extensions etc and even upgrading the complete system uh, to the latest version can be obtained from the marketplace itself 